Hello learners welcome back to the learners academy i am dr rishi and today we are diving in a significant day in the history of india yes the independence day celebrated annually on august 15th this day marks the culmination of long and hard fought struggle against the colonial rule it's a day of pride unity and reflection of millions of indians around the globe join us as we explore how india achieved its independence and why august 15th is celebrated with such enthusiasm to understand the significance of independence day we must first take a look back at the history of british rule in india the british east india company began its rule in india in 1757 after their victory in the battle of plassey over the next 100 years the company expanded its control over vast regions of the indian subcontinent leading to significant economic exploitations and political domination the indian economy was restructured to serve the british interest with traditional industries dismantled and a focus on exporting raw material to britain this led to widespread poverty and famines in india in addition to economical exploitation social and cultural changes were imposed causing resentment among indians but indians didn't stay silent the struggle of independence began with the revolt of 1857 also known as the first war of independence though it was ultimately suppressed this uprising ignited a spark of large movements and brought to light the need for a unified struggle against colonial rule the key faces in this struggle were rani lakshmi bai of jhansi mangal pande nana saheb tatya tope man singh and kuwar singh fast forward to the late 19th century and early 20th century when the indian national congress and other political organizations were established laying the groundwork for organized political action this period saw the rise of several key figures who played crucial role in the fight for freedom including mahatma gandhi subhash chandra bose sardar vallabhbhai patel lokmanya tilak Lala Lajpat Rai, Bipin Chandra Pal, and many more. A parallel armed movement was also started, where the key figures were Chandrasekhar Azad, Khudiram Bose, Bhagat Singh, Udham Singh, Ram Prasad Bismil, Ashfaqullah Khan, Vasudev Balwant Phadke, Vinayak Damodar Savarkar, Batukeshwar Dutt, Sukhdev Thapar. शिवराम हरी राजगुरु दुर्गावती देवी मदन लाल ढिंगरा अल्लूरी सीताराम राजू रस बिहारी बोस एंड मेनी मोर महात्मा गांधी इमर्ज एज अ सेंट्रल फिगर विथ हिज फिलासफी ऑफ नॉन वॉयलेंस एंड सिविल डिसोबिडियंस दिस मेथड इंस्पायर मिलियंस अक्रॉस द नेशन टू पार्टिसिपेट इन मूवमेंट्स सच एज द नॉन कोऑपरेशन मूवमेंट ऑफ नाइनटीन the dandi march of 1930 and the quit india movement of 1942 the non cooperation movement en- encouraged indians to boycott british goods institutions and honors signaling a massive push of self reliance meanwhile the dandi march also known as the salt satyagraha wa- was a direct action campaign against the british salt tax mobilizing people from all walks of life The Quit India movement of 1942 was a call for immediate independence and saw large scale protests across the country. Despite the British government's attempt to suppress it through arrests and crackdowns. Despite fierce opposition and numerous setbacks, Indians remained determined. The end of the World War II marked the turning point as 
Britain was weakened and facing economical difficulties. The relentless efforts of the Indian leaders and the freedom fighters finally paid off as negotiation with British led to the end of the colonial rule. On August 15, 1942, India achieved independence, marking the end of nearly 200 years of British rule. Pandit Jawaharlal Nehru, the first Prime Minister of independent India, delivered his historic Trist with Destiny speech emphasizing the dawn of a new era. However, the joy of independence was accompanied by the pain of partition. The division of British India into India and Pakistan led to widespread communal violence and the displacement of millions of people. Today, Independence Day is celebrated with great zeal and enthusiasm across India. The Prime Minister hoists the national flag, the beloved tricolour, at the Red Fort in New Delhi, followed by a grand parade that showcases India's cultural diversity and military strength. This is a day when people from all corners of the country come together to celebrate the spirit of freedom. Schools, colleges and communities organize events where students perform patriotic songs, dances and plays reminding us of the sacrifice made by freedom fighters. Streets and buildings are adorned with the tricolor and everyone participates in various patriotic activities. But beyond the parades and festivities, Independence Day is a time to remember the sacrifice of countless individuals who fought for our freedom. It's a moment to reflect on the values of democracy, equality and unity that forms the foundation of our nation. While we celebrate our freedom, it's crucial to recognize that the journey of nation building continues. Independent Day is also a reminder of our responsibilities to uphold the principle of justice, liberty and fraternity. Each of us plays a role in shaping the future of our country, ensuring that the progress made over the years benefits every citizen. As we look ahead, let's honor the legacy of our freedom fighters by working towards more equitable and prosperous society. Remember, every small step counts in making a significant difference. Thank you for joining us today. If you found this video informative, don't forget to like, comment and subscribe.